हेलो माय डियर स्टूडेंट यू आर वाचिंग द एजुकेशनल चैनल मुनमुन वक्ता ट्यूटोरियल एंड आई योर मैथमेटिक्स टीचर मुनमुन सर हैज प्रेजेंटेड बिफोर यू विथ अ न्यू चैप्टर ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स एंड दैट इज इरेशनल नंबर यस माय स्टूडेंट दिस क्लास इज वेरी यूजफुल फॉर द स्टूडेंट ऑफ क्लास 9 इन द प्रीवियस क्लास वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड दैट how can we represent a rational number on number line and the second how can we get one or more rational numbers between two rational numbers and today in this class we will discuss about how can we represent an irrational number on number line so dear student please be ready with your notebook and a pen and without wasting the time i just come to the point and for this we take an example root 2 you can see this on the screen we have to represent this irrational number on number line and for this we have to follow some steps step one we take a straight line as you are watching on the screen we take a straight line and mark 0 1 2 3 dot 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 and in the left side of 0, minus 1, minus 2, dot, dot, dot. A step 2. We draw a perpendicular line on of 1 unit at point 1. This is a perpendicular line of 1 unit. You can see and we mark all the three points P, Q and R and we get a right angle triangle here P, Q, R and now we have P, Q is equal to one unit and Q, R is equal to also one unit a step third now we will find pr you can see on the screen pr using pythagoras theorem and that is root 2 if you don't know the pythagoras theorem i just explain it you can see here this is a right angle triangle ABC. ABC is a right angle triangle, and here AB is the base, BC is the perpendicular, AC is the hypotenuse, and if we have to find hypotenuse we use the formula hypotenuse h is equal to root under p square plus b square and for base b is equal to root under h square minus p square and for perpendicular p is equal to root under h square minus b square this is the pythagoras theorem and we have used here h is equal to root under p square plus b square to find pr you can watch here this is h is equal to root under p square plus b square 
and so pr is equal to this pr is equal to p square plus b square here p means perpendicular is one unit so i have put the value of p one unit here one square you can see on the screen and b square means base here base is one unit and so i have put the value of base one unit one square and now by calculation we get root under 2 and this root under 2 we note here pr this is the value of pr clear now a step four and now p is a center and pr as a radius we draw an arc which touch at point root 2 on number line and this is our answer you can see this arc this is pr and we have draw an arc dot 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 and this touch point root 2 on number line and this is our answer okay clear student yes now i take another example and that is root 3 how can we represent root 3 on number line we have to understand this and for this we just follow the all previous step and find pr is equal to root 2 yes pr is equal to root 2 and now the further step here we draw a perpendicular line at point r and this is r is of one unit and here again we get a right angle triangle p r s p r s you can see on the screen here and now in triangle p r s we will find the value of p s using pythagoras theorem so i have solved it here in triangle prs ps is equal to root under 2 square because here base is root under 2 this root under 2 root under 2 square plus 1 square perpendicular is 1 and by solving we get root 2 into root 2 is equal to 2 1 into 1 1 2 plus 1 is equal to 3 and this is root 3 and now p as a center and p s as a radius we draw an arc which touch the point root 3 on number line and this is our answer you can watch this on the screen this is our answer any doubt student clear yes now we take another example root under 5 how can we represent root under 5 on number line and for this just try to understand similarly we take a, take a straight line and this time we take two unit on base why because root under 5 is greater than root uh, root 4 root 4 means 2 root under 5 is greater than 2 or root under 4 you can say there therefore we will take two unit 
on base here and draw a perpendicular line at q and find pr using pythagoras theorem you can watch this on a screen in triangle pqr pr is equal to root under 2 square because this is 2 unit and plus 1 square this is 1 unit and by solving we get root under 5 and once again p as a center and pr as a radius we draw an arc which touch at point root under 5 on number line and this is our answer clear yes and now homework for you so you can please note some homework for practice dear students i hope your doubts will have been cleared and if you think this video is very useful for you you should like it share it and subscribe it so please note the homework